It really was a shit off type of day today and uh, perfect for the theme uh, as Mattel really dropping the heat this month. Um, stick around as we have a look at uh, the drop just passed and also what's coming up uh, for the rest of the month. <laughs> There's really some fire on the way. Hi guys, welcome back to this week's episode. Yeah, like I mentioned, uh, this week, oh, this 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 week and then uh, this month uh, has really been a good one for for the RLC. Um, first drop of May uh, was the Pagani Huayra uh, R. Uh, it's uh, today is Friday, so the drop was yesterday. I believe it's still available. Um, I, I didn't check today or, or late late ish today. Um, but yeah, it's it's uh, it wasn't wasn't uh, all sold out uh, when I last checked. But it's just one of those cars that I think the biggest compliment I can give it is it doesn't look like a Hot Wheel. It looks like a one of these other premium brands that concentrate more on 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 sp specific detail and and it's it really is a, an excellently executed model. Um, I mean, I don't like the Pagani's as as a as a rule, um, just as a manufacturer, I, I don't, I don't really care for the for the look of the cars. Um, obviously, they they tend to sort of look alike as well. Um, but this, I, I can really appreciate this. This is this is something uh, something really nice. I'll obviously scroll uh, some footage and and some photos um, of which there's, there's quite a bit. Um, but yeah, I, I don't think I'll probably end up getting one. Um, but if you're looking for something that that looks really really nice uh it's well executed as i said almost un hot wheel like uh that that would be that would be a good starting point um and then the, we can take a look at the um uh at the drop calendar for the rest of the month uh on the 14th uh, i believe uh, lots of people have got that date circled um it's it's the skyline the latest rlc skyline drop um it's going to be, uh, I think, the fourth color uh, for this skyline uh, in RLC. So we've had the um, the blue, the purple, uh, the the chrome just behind me uh, with the Miz, the Nismo uh, deco, and this one is going to be uh, what they call the chameleon colors, uh, sort of a bluish purple. But obviously, it's one of those um, sort of not co not color changing, but you know what I mean by chameleon. It that sort of Depending on the angle and the lighting, the color tends to change uh, or look look different shades of, of blue, blue and purple. Um, I'll I'll put up some pictures. Uh, obviously, there's been quite a quite a bit released. Uh, it was featured um, at at the uh, at the nationals uh, just past. Um, so that that was a popular uh, a popular display model, uh, and we have seen uh, we we've seen the the pictures of the body uh, being released in the previous couple of months as well. So that's one that's been doing the rounds for a bit. Uh, I believe it's also going to be on pre-order. Um, so there might be a couple to go around. I, I believe in the forums they mentioned a limit of three per person. Uh, so you should be able to grab one uh, regardless of whether or not you have the overdrive uh, subscription or not. Um, you will obviously still have to have your active membership. Um, so yeah, I uh, might, might pick up uh, one or two of those, uh, they, they might, they might, um, obviously not, they're not going to skyrocket in value as the blue and purple ones did, um, just because of the numbers, uh, if they are going to be releasing them in that sort of numbers, um, might not, might, I mean, it's, it's not going to, I think, do as well on the resale market, so I, I don't think that's a reason to pick them up, but, but the, but the color itself, uh, could be something to build. Um, and then a little later on in the month, towards the, I think it's the last last uh, drop of the month or second to last drop of the month so is going to be the last one for for Hot Wheels, um, is going to be the Bugatti in the um, uh, in the uh, Elite 64. So I don't know if they're planning on doing a, an Elite 64 release each month. Uh, so I, in the previous video, I, I, I had that um, the the orange Porsche, uh, and hopefully by the time I make next week's video. Uh, we'll be doing an un unboxing feature and I'll have it in hand. Um, so I'm hoping if the courier company comes through, uh, we should be able to get a closer look uh, at that as well. Uh, it's going to be the uh, the Bugatti. Um, I forget the type, but it's uh, it's one of those old, really old vintage races. 
um, I'll, I'll, I'll uh, roll some footage and, and some pictures. Uh, we've seen quite a bit uh, also in the last couple of days. Uh, as the announcement was made on the 1st of May when they update the calendar, people have been scrambling for, for a couple of pic pictures uh, and there have been some doing the rounds. So I'll, I'll post the pictures up for that. So yeah, lots of fire this month. Uh, not so good for the wallet. Um, I've seen a couple of people say, "Look, it's it's been great, but uh, we need we need to give the wallet a break." Um, so yeah, I, I think um, a few of the drops of the last couple of weeks have been either either pre-orders or uh, the release date is. Um, so I don't think it's made to order. I, th I think there is still a, a, a cap on the numbers, uh, but it is a bit more than what, what it usually is. So you, it's been difficult to, to gauge how well the Overdrive um, subscription has really worked. Uh, I, I've, I think, honestly, uh, people, I've seen more positive feedback than negative. Um, there were obviously the odd um, payment issue or still with the capture checking they they still had the loop um no that wouldn't have been no they they don't do the capture that it's actually added the, um i did see payment issues though um where they had placed an order that you obviously have to cancel you have to opt out of the orders if you don't want the want the cars um and so so there were a couple of people that that said that they had opted in or stayed in for one but the payment wasn't processed um, but I think they, with a, just a quick call or an email to customer services, they were able to sort that out. So, so no major hiccups uh, as of yet. Um, I don't think I've seen too many people miss out on something that they weren't supposed to miss out on. Um, so, so far, so good. Um, although, like I said, we haven't really had a chance to, to gauge just quite how well that works when the numbers are very limited for an item. So. Uh, I think one of the releases coming up will probably give us a better. Uh, if if they aren't, then then maybe in the month of um, month of June we might we might get a better idea if it's if it's not pre-order or if it's or it's not made to order uh, these cars. Uh, the Elite 64s. I had an issue when I placed the order for mine where it showed up as sold out two minutes into the sale. Um, so that was a bit strange. I had to go back and forth a bit. I had to log out of my account and then just have a look at the product page or view the product page as a guest, so not signed in, and then sort of process the, the order that way. Um, so I did end up getting one. Um, uh, I, I, I did get back into my uh, account to, to finish the order. Um, and then from then on, uh, it also showed as in stock for, for quite a while. So I don't know how many other people, I, like I was reading through the, the comments immediately uh, when it showed as sold out so quickly and people were just saying no, they, they could still get it. So a uh, bit of back and forth. Um, so there are still some glitches, um, but, but I think so far the numbers, the production numbers have, have made up for that. So yeah, that's that's my quick update on RLC drops this month uh, and what's what's ahead. And uh, yeah, like I said, next week hopefully the courier company comes through. Uh, we should be doing a, a pretty big unboxing. Uh, I had I picked up some items today locally. I'll save that for the unboxing as well. Uh, so we'll have a look look at a, at a nice nice decent uh, stash. All right, keep well. See you next week. Cheers.